É o Fei! Sit! Sit! Sit, Elfie! Sit, Elfie! That'll do! Morning, welcome back to Kiwi Farmer. Just down here at the lease block. Um, finally, ah, that land's about to jump out. Oh, you little bugger. So Daniel's uh, been and gone, just um, ran through those lambs that we pulled out and he just put his hand on them. So that's just a way of figuring out whether they're prime enough to go to the works and get the best value out of them, essentially. Um, so there's only 35 here and 58 at home. Um, not the 150 here that we were kind of looking for, which is a bit frustrating. Um, it's just this season keeps kicking in the guts. Um, so a lot of overcast, crappy days like this, um, which lambs need sun and heat to grow, to do well. Um, so they just haven't had that. So yeah, like I've been saying, they're two to three weeks probably behind in their growth rates, um, just with the rough start that they got. Um, and then the, you know, the shitty cold early spring that we had. So, yeah, not much you can do about it. Um, we'll get these 90 odd away at a good price. Um, so I'll update you guys when we, um, we get the kill sheet back and, and see what we got value-wise for them. Um, <sighs> yeah, so I just gotta crutch these up and uh, go and draft up the ones we did yesterday. We were at waiting for the trucks, so yeah. We'll throw some leggings on and and uh, get into these. All right, all crushed up. Uh, we'll just load up. We didn't actually end up using the racehorse here, so we'll just load up some gates and head home. Draft out the other lot. The old work tune's pretty good. Mundane tasks like crutching listen to some music and go about and get the job done. Right, see you at home. Right, drafted them up and the old yards are a bit of a mess. It's uh, not good for trying to keep your lambs clean before they go on the truck. But um, oh well, that's what we've got to deal with. So uh, I'll just set the load ramp up and uh, we'll shoot back down to the lease block, wait for the truck to turn up at 11 o'clock. Right, so those ones all loaded up. And um, there's a bugger that ramp, but uh, I don't know. I don't know why they were balking, not running up there well, but anyway. Uh, off to the Grange, back home. Truck's got to go around the long way, because he can't get through the Ford, because we had some rain. Um, and the Ford is, well, it's flowing at the moment. But we'll, uh, yeah, we'll get through there. There is first load of uh, weaned lambs 2021 out the drive. So yeah, not the number I was hoping for, but um, what do you do? We'll um, continue to try and whip them around and grow the ones that are still on mum. Uh, 
and yeah have another draft up in about a fortnight uh the 20th of the week before christmas um hopefully i think a lot of people are in the same boat so yeah it'd be nice if the price stays up as well which i think it will i don't think they've got this, the numbers of lambs uh, coming through so yeah we'll remain we will remain positive um right lunchtime and uh don't know don't know what i'll do this afternoon shift some stock around i think shift some cows and calves and bits and pieces so. Hey, good day. so it's been a couple of days since we sent those lambs away to the works uh, just got the kill sheet back um, here and yeah not the flashes uh, so price is not too bad nine dollars um, just pretty good actually uh, but they they killed out 16.9 kilos so um, yeah hundred and well, I got it down here, $147, um, which is just a bit, a wee bit less than nine. If you take away the, the deductions, you know, um, plant inspection fee and beef and lamb levy and bits and pieces like that. So, um, yeah, just another another part of a challenging season. So we just applied for an increase in overdraft um, by another 20000 just to try and uh, get us through till the end of January hopefully until we you know uh, until we get some sunshine and some warm weather and we actually get some lambs that are starting to grow and we can hopefully play some catch up with some uh, Italian and some Raffino that we've got in the ground um, yeah yep so just trying to manage uh, the the yeah the season <laughs> it seems to be one thing after another so um, no anyway um, no point in dwelling on it we we'll just do what we can do so uh yeah that'll end it for this video thanks for watching um and yeah we'll just get about to go and tidy up the wall shed because we're shearing hoggets with lambs at foot tomorrow so um yeah we'll tidy up the wall shed be the first time we use it since um since we replaced the roof after the wind and uh yeah we'll film all that we'll show you all that in the next video